So we've got Catherine and Jones coming this morning, everyone. Why we do this um, is not just to come in and get someone to talk nicely about us, but it's actually put in mind with everyone that we actually are working with humans and improving their lives. Yeah, we Previously. like we just so what's like, the difference this, between you know how seeing you often them with quotes you get like say three. Mm -hmm. So I think I went to two places, Helen went to two places and um, yeah, well Helen had a good feeling about it, but it was, as you said it wasn't just feeling, it was hard facts of yes. how it worked and um, yeah, just looking <coughs> at what you did on like, like places you listed. So the other two, mum's sister and mum's brother, um, had listed theirs and they'd been on the market, um, I don't know, eight months or something like that. But I think the fact, the fact that those two were with a different company and hadn't sold, we came in having that information on board, which you know, made it pretty straightforward. Yes, and so you've met a couple of different people, so when Liam um, walked in, why did you feel he was the man to work with? Oh, well, he came across as a very nice man. Yes, yeah. very, very prof professional and friendly. Yes. Very nice, yes. And he actually, like, Mum's hearing is really, cognitively she's perfect, hearing is really bad, so he actually kind of got down and was at Mum's height yes. and spoke to her directly. And he very carefully went through every point. He didn't rush us and so that's something else I appreciated. Oh, that's great. Didn't feel like any pressure, but but also very informative. Yes. Mum is making all her own decisions and Helen and I are supporting her in that. Mm -hmm. Yes. Liam also did text and follow up phone call with me as well. And I said, Liam, you don't need to do that. Just can go through Helen. He said, no, I like to keep you both informed. There was a contract drawn up and signed and then an open house on this, that was a Wednesday, then open house Saturday, and then mum signed the contract the next Wednesday. Yeah, so it certainly wasn't an eight month affair, yeah, was it? Yeah, and that was so, well, that was really appreciated to have that time frame tight. You were in a position where you were talking to someone that was trying to choose between like working with love or working with another agency, <laughs> what would you tell them? Love, definitely. Yes. <laughs> we already have, we already oh, have. Fantastic. Yep. And I wrote a testimonial. I'm not telling you anything your staff don't know, but the marketing fee, yes. that's one something, I don't know if you're unique in that, but that's something that's different to the other three companies we spoke about. I think some were like a thousand, some were 1500. Mm. Yeah, nothing, you absorbed it. Yeah, yeah. completely and sold it in a week. So. Yeah. Yeah, no, we're, we're really, really happy. Mum's gone where she's living, that's where her brother and sister-in-law, who she lived next door for six out years, she's still with them. Oh, so have, oh, have, oh, we, oh, have breakfast, good. lunch and yes. dinner together. And, and that Mara and Ken being, yes, yeah. they, we lived next door neighbours for 67 years. Oh, 67, yeah. Yeah, so now we'll be there for the rest of our life, I think. <laughs> Good partnership. Yeah. Joan, thank you so much for coming oh, in. Oh, thank you. These are for you. Oh, thank you very much. You're very, very oh, welcome. Really. Oh, thank and you. You can let the, let the oh, social media oh, move in. Oh, thank you. Thank you. Long, long since I had flowers given to me by a man. <laughs>